this is going to hurt. We have to get gasoline. Today is the last day before we start our trip back to Switzerland. Uh, I will miss this view. And also the breakfast you get here for just 3 euros. This is big. Last preparations. Very good job, Nikki. It's always hard to leave a beautiful place like this. But yeah, also glad to get home, see all my friends. Two and a half thousand kilometers way home starts now. Now we will go and grab some snacks for the ride. Uh, we also have to wash the clothes. I don't have any fresh underwear anymore. How about to change? <laughs> we have to wait quite long and I'm bored. So my question is, does a person fit inside of here? I think yes. Nikki? I think the question is, can Timo do a whole spin? Or how many spins can he do once he's in there? Let's see. I'm not sure if it's made for your way to spin it. Okay, let it come out. Uh, all the yoga pays out, eh? Mm -hmm. We finally can wash. <laughs> now let's go and get some snacks. <laughs> Choose wisely. We're good to go. Finito. Three, two, one, go. Two hours of waiting and laundering and drying the clothes, and the clothes are still not drying and they're not smelling that good. But we cannot lose more time. We will leave now. Let's go to Spain. Hey. First day of driving is over. Where are we? Here is even like a little camper spot. That's our spot for tonight. Because none of our clothes is dry, is this the transformation from a van to a drying room? <laughs> yeah, that's van life. You gotta be creative sometimes. Good morning! Didn't sleep very long. This is our parking here. We were actually quite lucky because it was the last spot. Mission for the morning, finding food without internet on a Sunday. But yeah, optimistic. That was very easy. Right when I stopped the video, I saw already a shop breakfast here. We are back on the road. Day two of our journey back home. Now let's go see in what a city we spent our night. We were very positive surprised. There are a lot of beautiful palaces and churches. There was also a training for some uh, tradition which normally happens at Easter. They carry some very heavy weights, how you've seen it in the video. It's like a symbolic gesture for Jesus Christ who had to carry his cross. At least we implement that. And now let's go back on the road. We are in 
Valencia, we are in the industry. Nikki is very hungry. You hungry? Oh. We're searching out something to eat. Maybe Asian, maybe Italian. We will see. Whatever is open now. Pure cuisine. Very tasty. Yeah, it's nice. There is some vegan chicken. Really similar to chicken. Almost at the parking. Very, very close. Very tired. We did it. Good morning. So we went to surfing. Uh, it was quite cold, so we have to warm up now. <laughs> My feet are still there super you know. cold. I, I really didn't expect the Mediterranean to be colder than the Atlantic, but it is. It is fucking cold. It feels like needles putting in your face every time when you do a duck dive. Uh, yeah, we had some good waves. So we warmed up a bit. Now. It's time to visit Valencia. You look like a tourist. When we were skating through this park, we were pretty sure that we will find somewhere a skate park and well, we found it. That was fun. Unfortunately, the ground is very slippery and it has a lot of dust on it. Good little break. Let's continue. See the city. I just witnessed the bicycle accident. It looked quite severe, but the guy is okay. The guy went over with the bicycle and green light was still on. It turned to red. The car driver drove and hit him and the bicycle driver really almost made a flip and landed on his head. Fortunately, the ambulance just passed by and could help, but yeah crazy so always keep out in the traffic guys back at the van we've seen Valencia a bit it has a really really nice park but now I'm quite done with a lot of skating yeah we had a really nice visit here in Valencia now it's time to go back to the roads uh, our next stop is Vinagos Vinagos something like this so yeah Two hours, so not too much distance to take. We just arrived at today's destination. It's not called Vinagos, it's called Vinaros. And I would say we have the first time again a little bit a beautiful parking spot for the night. This is our parking spot. Woohoo! Nice view. And tomorrow we will have bad weather, so we work a bit and then probably go to Barcelona. Yeah, it's getting colder tonight. As soon as you went out of the sleeping bag or out of the blanket. Oh, and chill. And yeah, it's only getting colder now. We are on the search for a cafe. Or let's say we are on the search for a toilet, internet and electricity. But apparently everything is closed in this city. But still all the parkings are occupied. Oh yeah, I don't get it. After a long time in a cafe looking for what we are doing. Because the weather is going to be very cold and we don't like the cold. We decided to make one more day here on the coast. After that, tomorrow when it's coming to rain and being very cold, we will just do a lot of kilometers. Or, he is doing a lot of kilometers. I am chilling here. Well, we arrived at our next spot. Um, where are we? 
I have no idea what the name is called, but yeah, this is our parking spot. Very nice, directly at the ocean. Only thing, we are very, very public here. So now let's go check out the place. And these waters, they are actually a thermal fountain. I don't know. My English is not perfect, how uh, you already know. Uh, yeah, we go and get our board shorts and go for a swim. How cold is it? It's okay. It's not so warm like we expected. But better than the ocean. Mm, the fish, they are not shy. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> we are just getting a free pedicure for free. Other people pay for it. <laughs> oh yeah, now after the fish had their meal, it's time that we have our meal. The bad weather has arrived. It's a good day to make some kilometers. So just to your information, we looked it up, how this place is called, it's Komaruka. Yeah. So yeah, next time you see this. Bye guys!